Now question D of exercise 5.1 says so find the square of the following proper fractions and compare with themselves. Problem number 1, 1 upon 5. Now let us find the square of 1 upon 5 by squaring it and solve it you will get 1 upon 25. Now comparing equivalent fractions with the given number and uh, the given numbers are 5 upon 25 and 1 upon 25. Here you may note it that uh, 1 upon 25 is less than 5 upon 25 or the square of a given number is less than given number. If you are uh, unable to identify that which number is greater than and which number is less than, then cross multiply the fractions like this. Now start multiplying numerator left hand side to right hand side denominator and right hand side denominator to left hand side numerator. You may note 5 means 1 upon 25 is less than 25 means 1 upon 5. In this cross multiplication method, you may clearly know that which will is greater than or which will be less than. Now problem number 2, 3 upon 7. Here first of all we have to find the square of the square of this proper fraction. The square of this proper fraction is 9 upon 49. Now if we compare this equivalent fraction with a given number then we will get the same number 3 upon 7. Now given numbers are this. Always remember the square of the given number is always less than the given number. It is very difficult to know that which number is less than or greater than to go no, to know that to just do cross multiplication like this. So square so 63 means square of 3 upon 7 is less than 147 means 3 upon 7. In the same way solve all other problem by yourself and please don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel and share this video to your friends on whatsapp through thanks
Now in question number E says uh, find the square of the following decimal numbers and compare with themselves. Problem number 1, 0.1. To find the square of given number 0, 01, we multiply 0, 1, 2 times or by simple fraction method you can find the square value easily. We will get 0 0.01, the square of 0, 1. Then remember, the square of the given number is always the less than itself. Now we know that which number is less than or greater than. To know this, just do cross multiplication. Cross multiplication is always happen between fraction values. First multiply numerator with other denominator and then multiply denominator with other numerator. Now you may clearly see 10 is the square value of 0 0.01 is less than 100 means given value 0 0.1. Now in the same way solve all other problem by yourself and like and subscribe my youtube channel. If you not subscribe or like my video then I will not solve coming exercise.